John Gill, Exposition of the Tower Bible, 1 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 3. Reading first from the King James Bible, quote, For our exhortation was not of deceit, nor of uncleanness, nor in guile, unquote. John Gill, quote, For our exhortation, or consolation, for the ministry of the gospel, which is here meant, consists of doctrines full of comfort to distressed minds, such as free justification by the righteousness of Christ, full pardon by his blood, and complete satisfaction by his sacrifice, as well as exhortations to the exercise of grace and discharge of duty. And this was not of deceit or error. It was not uh, fallacious, as the Ethiopic version renders it. It consisted of nothing but truth. It was the word of truth and the truth as it is in Jesus, nor did it proceed from any in, in, intentions to deceive or impose on persons. It was no imposture, nor of uncleanness, it did not spring from any impure affection for any sin, nor popular applause or worldly interest, nor did the ministers of it contrive at uncleanness in others or practice it themselves, as did the false teachers, but bore the testimony against it, both in word and example, and taught no doctrine that encouraged to it. On the contrary, the, doc the doctrine which is according to good godliness and which teaches men to deny ungodliness and worldly lust, nor in guile, as there was no deceitful design in the ministry of the word, nor anything impure and immoral in the matter of it. So there was no artificial use in the dispensing of it. It was plain and simple, without any color in guile, without the hidden things of dishonesty, without craftiness in handling the word deceitfully. And this is a reason why the apostles preached it with so much freedom and boldness, because it was nothing false impure or artful in it, unquote. King James Version, quote, For our exhortation was not of deceit, nor of uncleanness, nor of guile, unquote. End of John Gill, chapter 2, verse 3.